Okie doke. Last time, if you remember, we were trying to feed the feral cat and running around getting sardines. Um, I may continue that. We'll see if I find some water. Uh, let's see what quest it thinks we're on. Not that we would continue that one anyway. There we go. Okay, so it says Perils of Ice Mountain. Lucky asked Delivery Dwarf to find a crate that fell off road north of Falador. Alright, I'm in Falador, I believe. I'm, I think I was going to look just in Falador, and then if I don't find it, I'm going to move on. Go get the kitty uh, sardines. Alright, so we're looking for a crate. Anyone see a crate? There's cr crawl down plant roots. Hmm. wonder what that means. Chop down tree. Anybody see a crate? Crate, crate, crate. Anybody? All kinds of plants and stuff. I wonder if it's a summer thing in my bobber. Yes. See, these are in the city. I was just thinking this might be it, and it might be worth looking. What's in here? This looks out of the way and conspicuous. No? Climb downstairs. I found a dungeon. Oh, this is that scorpion dungeon. Good old King Scorpion. I popped down right by him. Easy peasy. Nothing. He didn't drop a thing. Probably gonna be another one that appears. Mine Iron Rock. Talk to Dwarf. Oh, this is the Dwarf area. So now I know where it pops up. Interesting. What are all those people doing? Oh. Whoop de doo. Gets me a lot of experience. Can't complain there. But I don't see a crate. It would be interesting if there was a crate somewhere around here. I'm going to walk around just in case. Dropping a thing, huh? Hey, looks like gold over here. Talk to Dwarf. I guess I'll talk to him. See what it is. Welcome to the Mining Guild. Can I help you with anything? What have you got in the guild? Oh, it's wonderful. There is Oracle Satite, Ruinite, Coal Rocks in the guild. All exclusively, but you have to be at least 60 mining. Okay. Rules are rules. Can I help you with anything else? Out of here. So I probably can't go in there. Yeah. Of course. There's a mysterious entrance down there. Um, looking for a crate. Luminite, whatever that means. Should we go down the mysterious entrance? What do you guys think? Of course, everyone always votes yes. Aw, Dungeoneering 15. How can I not be 15 by now? This Dungeoneering is allowing you to get into dungeons. 
probably an important one. I saw something say crevice. There we go. Squeeze through crevice. I'm sneaking in. Oh, there's a mine card over there too. Oh, not small enough. Need more oil. Dwarves over here. This place looks awfully familiar. This looks like up on the mountain. How am I up on the mountain even though I'm down here on the ground? Ah, the mysteries. Climb rope. Okay. Just for kicks. No crates at all. What's this up ahead? Where is it? Over here. Something in here. Open chest. Nothing. And nothing. And all of about nothing. Talk to Hira. Hello, Mangler3M. Hello, what is it you've got there? A crossbow, are you interested? Maybe, are they any good? Are they any good? War of an engineering at its best. How do I make one? Well, firstly, you need to chop yourself some wood, then a knife with wood, wheel out a nice crossbow stock like these here. Wood fletched into stock, check. Get yourself some metal and a hammer. Smith some limbs on for the bow. Mind that you use the right metals and woods through as some wood or is do light to use with some metal and vice versa. Which goes with which? Wood and bronze is their basic materials. Oak and blurite. Willow and iron. Steel and teak. Mithril and maple. Adamantine and... Adamantite and mahogany. And finally, ruinite and you. Ah, uh, many... I have my stock and my pair of limbs. Now what? Take a hammer. Smack the limbs firmly into stock. You'll need a string. They're not as the same as normal bows. You need to dry some large animal's meat to giant sinew, then spin that on the spinning wheel. That's the only thing we found strong enough for a crossbow. What about magic logs? Well, I don't rightly know. Us dwarves don't make the magic. We prefer gold and rock, much more stable. I guess you could ask the humans as the rangers killed to see if they can do something, but I don't want anything to do with it. Thanks for telling me. Bye. Take care. Straight shooting. All right. So I learned something. Another dwarf over here. Oh, I'm attacking him. Yeah. Don't want to do that. Unattack. Heart conductor. Where can you take me? Well, I could have taken you to this place. What's that? Grand capital of all the dwarven realm. Here's a ladder. Let's try that, see where it takes me. You can't use it until you finish that Pearls of Ice Mountain quest. Okay. Greetings. Welcome to my pickaxe. Do you want premium quality pickaxe? Whoa. I can afford them. Mining damage. Ah, so they mine faster. 
Interesting. You have to equip that one as your main weapon? Let's find out. I'm just testing it out. And I'll save it in case I ever get back to mining. Maybe it'll save time. Or maybe I'll get something better out of it. Talk to Boot. Hello, Boot. Hello, tall person. Hello, short person. What was that on the ground? Bronze chain body. Hey. Nice. 34 melee. Hmm. Any mineables? Here we go, copper. Let's see if I'm allowed to do some copper. Okay, so that was two swings. Each swing's getting me 77. What if we go to this special one right here? Does it get me anything better? Five damage. Okay, so... Where'd that other pickaxe I just bought go? Iron pickaxe. So I'm switching to the iron pickaxe and now I'm trying and seeing if I get more than... 6 EXP. Backpack is full. Okay, I don't, I don't know what to do with all this extra copper ore anyway. I'm just looking for experience. This one's sparkling over here. 35? Oh, so you just keep an eye on which one's sparkling and then go get it. One EXP? Two EXP? One EXP? This one was better. I'm not really sure. It is unclear as to what is better. Yeah, I gain way more when I use whatever I'm using now.
Alright. Somebody's gonna get a big Christmas present for lots of copper if they head in that room. I'm looking for the ladder. I think it's here maybe. There's a ladder. Yay. Oh, I came up a different place. Look where I ended up. This is that mining area. Huh. So it was all connected under, under underground. Alright. I was going to look for... So Ice Mountain. So it said something about north. This is a trail north. And this said Ice Mountain. So I wonder... If I went east and then... Eh, it's not really a... Uh, it's not really recommended. I kind of want to go find. I want to go find something. Let's see if I can check I'm gonna try fishing right around here and see if I can get some sardine. I think that's the only part I didn't go to last time. This fishing spot, I see it on the map right there. Any fishing? Where did they, they mark it? I don't see it. Maybe it's right there. Net fishing spot. Net fishing spot is just gonna be a bunch of shrimp. spot up here. Need the kind you cast in them real me. Use fairy ring? I can't get there. Wish I could learn how to swim. Nothing? I can swim.
How about over here? I, I skipped this area too last time. I'm gonna go down south and then go east and then south. Hopeful. Nothing less I get to explore, find more stuff. So many details. Excuse me, pardon me. Giant rat. Here we go. Up over here. Net fishing again. Talk to the camel. Aww. Talk to the the camel. What an interesting name. If they let me through here. Oh, yeah. I am sorry, Effendi, but you need to be on a member's world to pass through. Yeah, you. Not that impressed, right? Open the jail door. Hmm. Can't fight them, huh? That might be a challenge, fighting four people. Full armor, full shields. Alright, so that was net fishing that we saw right there. Any more fishing over there? It's, on the map it shows other places over here. Let me just double check here. More net fishing. It's nothing else. Nothing else. Talk to the fisherman. Here we go. Let's try this one. Marked on your map, second floor of the White Knight's Castle in Falador. Gotta set the bar where you can reach it. Drew me a line. How oh, nice. That witch is bouncing up and down. All these statues. Every time I see water, I was thinking fish, fish. There's gotta be fish. Sardines. Something. Alright, so it says I need to go this way. Now, whether or not this is even possible... See, that's broken. Then. Yeah.
talk to Squire Serilyn. Hi, Serilyn. Bye, Serilyn. Okay, so second floor. Now this is second floor in America, but we are in England, so we gotta go up to the third floor, which is now called the second floor. Okay, they're saying go back downstairs. Back down to the first floor. Sir Amic Vars. Not even play on words. I mean something. Amik Varzi. I bet it was up upstairs one more. I think I was right and the little arrow was wrong. It slid me wrong before. Why would it do anything? Suit of armor I can search. Interesting. Probably best not to rifle through the night's below. You know what? You gave me that option. That is a short, 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 short. Alright, I'm ignoring the arrow and I'm going upstairs. Amik Varzi, I told you he was up on the third floor. I seek a quest. How about you know anything about Siege of Falador? Ah, yes, the Kinshra Siege was a close run thing indeed. All hope seemed lost. When she returned, Kara Mare, with Sir Theod Theodore at her side. Sir Theodore, I haven't seen anyone of that name around here. No, you wouldn't have. He is no longer with us. Oh, I'm sorry. So am I, young man. So am I. I seek a quest. Quest, say? Well, I don't know anything on the go at the moment, but there's an organization that's always looking for capable adventurers to assist them. Would you like me to put your name forward to them? Ah, oh, this is it. I will accept. Oh, not allowed to do that. So why don't I just delete that one? Why do they even have that on there? Ah, defeat or evade level 54 enemies. That looks like a challenge. Let's try it. It's short. All right. Squire ass roll. Just as in the castle, I didn't recall seeing anybody by that name. Great. Hmm. It's a different quest. Looking for crates. Of course, I'm not in the right place. Let's see if I can bounce around there. Maybe I'll bump into Azrol while I'm here. I don't know. Name doesn't ring a bell, but. Somewhere. There we go. Search the crates. That 
be a no. So I don't think there's anything on this floor. I wonder if I went to a different floor, because it said it was going to guide to go to the next place. Hey, a ladder. I <laughs> just locked him in there. He didn't seem to care. Climb to the top. All right. Go down this way, sure. Who goes there? Interesting. Hey, there he is. I found him. That's so weird. I'm the squire to Sir Vian. How's your life? Would you prefer to be a squire for me? No, sir. I have loyalty to Vivian. How's your life as a squire? Well, Sir Ryan is a good guy to work for. However, I'm in a spot of trouble today. I've gone and lost his sword. Do you know where he lost it? Well, if I knew that, I wouldn't be lost now, would I? Do you know the vague area you lost it in? Nope. Carrying it for him. From where he had it stored in Lumbridge. Must have slipped off my pack during the trip. You know what people like me are like me nowadays. Somehow, someone will just picked it up and kept it for themselves. Well, I hope you find it. Or I can make you a new sword if you like. Kingdom is fairly abundant with swords. Yeah, you can get bronze swords everywhere, but this isn't any sword. The sword is a family heirloom. It's been passed down through the family for five generations. It was originally made by the Imkando Dwarves, who were a particularly skilled tribe of Dwarven Smiths. I doubt anyone could make it in the style they do. So these dwarves make another one? Would these doors make another one? Not 100% sure that the tribe exists anymore. I should think Reldo, the palace librarian in Baruch, will know. He's done a lot of research in the races at Galenum. I don't suppose you could try track down the uh, dwarves for me. I've got so much work to do. All right, I'll give it a go. Best to start would be with Rita. Let's check the map, see if Rita is marked. Probably not. They just marked where I am. Uh. Palace Library. Here we go. There's Varok. There's the palace.
We want Rito in the library. This, I believe, is the king. Or Zinnia. Yep, there's the king. I don't see any libraries around here. There's a kitchen. Bookcase over there. I wonder if that's it. Bookcase might be a little library. There we go, that's a lot of books. And there is a Reldo. Rito, Reldo, whatever. What do you know about the Imkando Dwarves? The Imkando Dwarves, you say? Ah, yes, for hundreds of years they were the world's best smithing... most skilled smiths. They used secret smithing knowledge passed down from generation to generation. Fortunately, about a century ago, the once thriving race was wiped out during the barbarian invasions of that time. Who are the... Oh, so are there any Imkando left at all? I believe a few of them survived, but with the bulk of their, gener their population destroyed, their numbers have dwindled even further. I believe I remember a couple living in Ascarnia near the cliffs in the Asgarnian Southern Peninsula, but they do tend to keep to themselves. They do not tend to tell people... Do, they tend not to tell people what they're in, the descendants of the Imkando, which is why people think that the tribe has died out totally, but you may well have more luck talking to them if you bring them some redberry pie. They really like redberry pie. Red berry pie. Okay. So if I ever get a red berry pie, I guess I can do that quest. No idea where I would get one of those. It's like all these miscellaneous stuff. You just have to get miscellaneous stuff for that. Alright, I'm going to try this one again. I don't remember exactly how to do this one, but I bet I might. It was like an island way out here in the middle of nowhere. Can I teleport to there? Oh, it's a boat, right. It's a boat. It's in that Port Samuel place. Yes. Yeah, serum. Or Sammer. Serum. So if I get a pie one day, I'll come back and do this quest. I should keep a notebook. Dude, what do you old pal? You go there by daylight or by night? I guess if I went there by daylight, but I could go get that load stuff. Oh, look, it took me right to here. Hey, look what I found. That is lucky. And a lever. Wow. How lucky is that? I can cross here. Sweet. 
I made progress. Look at that, everybody. Alright. This guy... There's another one. Yep, I see a lever right there. So I need to hide over here. Whoa, he goes in circles. What? Oh no, 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 no. Don't move. Wow, he's very convenient in the way he walks. Now I'm nervous. Alright, he's going in a circle also. I bet there's something, or maybe I just go past him. Maybe there's nothing to kill him and you just have to time it right. Yeah, I bet this one you just have to time it right. It's gonna be fun. I'm terrible with these timing ones. Oh no. This one up oh, here we go. Oh, both of them. Double trouble. Sweet. Is that bird up there? We're cruising. Oh no, another body. Not a good sign. Oh, another guy. There's a chest over there, but I'm afraid to go there because... I'm gonna go there. Cross my fingers. Think I can make it? 500 coins and three uncut sapphires. Sweet! Bet that's a good thing. Alright, what do we gotta do? Just time it right? Are there two of them? There are two. Oh boy. That has to be the perfect timing to get away from there. See anything? Anything? Two? Three? Oh no 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 no! Go 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 go! Don't get seen or you will get your... Put the fish in the barrel. I'm being followed. There we go, right there. Go, 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 go! Yes! Success! Alright! Another one. It's a scout, not a warrior. I've fought these before. And a chest, just probably to distract you. So I could run, or I could fight him. I think I'm gonna fight him. Because if I fight with one in front. Oh, I have no fishies to heal. I forgot to stock up on fishies. Do I have any food at all? going to be interesting. I could just make a break for it. Then I'll miss this chest. I'm going to go grab the chest and get the thing and then run for it because I don't think I can fight them all off. Shadow hanging over me. Hey, one at a time. Oh, 
Stop running, stop running. Wow, I did it. I kinda don't want to, but I kinda do. I should definitely take this minnow. Yeah, and then that way I'll get some more from feeding him. I think it'll all work out. As long as another one is here. Checking the crates, anything, anything. good for me. Ooh, that was close. Taking all of these. Eating all of them. Progress. Okay. What's up this ladder? I know I'm getting on a boat. There's probably a bad monster up here. Just guessing. Oh my gosh. Those are two, three, four. What are you doing? I'm glad I can hit it. I thought maybe I'd need some kind of range. Okay. Be close. One more hit. Last one. Ooh, we're close. Did I just die? I think I killed it. Oh no. Oh my gosh, I got the main head right now. Yeah, this is not happening. They put me right in front of him. Am I full health? I am full health. I can find him again, but full health. Maybe I should try ranged on this guy. After he beats me again. I'll switch to ranged and then I'll knock out the uh, bat and then I'll try to get him from far away. Or magic I suppose. Got him halfway. Alright, let's put this bow on. Do I need arrows or is this... Nope. 
What's that hitting me? I can't hit it? If I had a lot of fishies and then I reattacked, I'd already beat it. So if I had left here, would it progress me to here or would it? I need to go get some one of those infinite section of fishies that slipped earlier in the quest. I can dump this, right? Well, let's go find some Guardian's gift. Double EXP. Um, no. So none of these are applicable. Can we just dump this? Destroy it. Yay! I guess more space. Okay. Alright, we're switching back to the Keen Blade so I don't forget that that's the best thing. I'm gonna try, where can I find some fishies? It says there's a bank over here, but I can't get to. It's a bank, it's in a bank. Ooh, search dead man's chest. That's probably my prize at the end. All right, let's go ahead and go down here. Can't go down there, okay. sure I got all the right armor and stuff. Okay, so I got pretty good helmet, holy symbol necklace, pathfinder jacket, trousers, blade, no no shield, I need a shield. Armor of potency, that's not much. Pretty lousy armor. Let me see, okay, so let's see if I look at the map, is there anywhere else I can go? Help me now. Why do you go back and examine it? I can't attack it. I think the only way to do it is just that the melee attack. Oh, that's cool. I can automatically teleport to these places. Where can I go to get a bunch of food that can heal me? Probably... Mm, lumber. We want food that heals a lot. So yeah, I have 2,000 
800. I need... It's for a store with some food in it. That would be a castle. Lots of free stuff like bowls and pots. I don't see any free free meals around here. Rat, and I can cook it. And... Let's look at the map. Maybe the map would give me a idea as to where it has food. There's a furnace over there. General store there. Okay, so if I if I leave and go to the general store, so if I go here. I think this right here is the general store. Can I help you? What are you selling? You are just selling random stuff. No food, huh? Gotta have food. No food at all. Alright, I'm gonna try selling stuff because I need to sell some stuff. Here, you can have my chef hat. You can have my... Iron pickaxe I just bought. <laughs> Could sell you runes, buckets of water, water runes. Nothing useful. And no food. Oh, here we go. Steal from the bakery stall. Maybe I can get some food out of there. Get your hands off there. Sorry about that. I was looking for food. Who's attacking me? There's crafting. There's seed. There's vegetable. Or vegetable. Is it buy? I mean, there's gotta be somebody selling. Is that woman a seller? Attack, you can't actually talk. That's weird. Did I get something? I got a cake. Wow. That's not a very good thing, but it's something. I got bread, that's better. Cake. 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 Now I would need roughly 2,800 health to win. This is 200, 200, 200, 200. There's only about a thousand. So I would need to dump a lot of this stuff and fill my space with a bunch of food. Alright, I'm going to dump these. Find an opal. Okay. Make pile of water? I have one.
made a potion? Well, I got space for two more. More cake. More cake. What does a magic potion do? I do not know. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So that'd be sixteen hundred. I'm close. But then if I lose, I lose everything probably. there's a bank just north of me. I wonder. I don't see it. It says it's right here. Oh, bank chest. Can I use this? Yes, I can. Okay, so let's see if there's anything else that heals more. And also, I can drop a bunch of stuff. as in two or three. Any food in here that's any good? There's raw beef, raw rat meat. That's kind of gross. Hey, attack potion. There we go. I can drink that. Cooked chicken. Wow, that cake is just as good as a cooked chicken. That's... You can't stack them. Wow. A meat pie. Ooh, that's even better. Bronze chain body. Okay, let's deposit that. Uncut opal. Deposit that. Deposit that. Oh, they stack. Beautiful. Bet that's out of space. But I think I have just enough space to... to make it. This one only heals 100, so it's not that... need more of these meat pies. We're going to need all of them. We're going to use the attack thing and then eat a whole bunch of food while we're fighting. We're also freeing up a lot of space. I'm out of space for food. I have to steal the rest of my bread. Leather cowl. Better than no armor. <laughs>
protein bar. That sounds like a food thing. Golden feathers got to be worth something. There's a crossbow. Two bronze cheap bucks. I like the least stack. Let's go for it. Let's go increase the attack and we get two more food thingies in it. Ooh. Path complete. Something happened. There we go. Look at that. All that food. Now we gotta go back to the port. And hopefully they'll warp me to the right place. And I can try again. Against the giant squid. That would be awesome. Attack potion. Attack plus two. Diminished one point per minute. Island of Ashdale by night. Shadow over Ashdale. They picked me in the perfect spot. Okay. So, drink the attack potion. Attack like crazy, heal like crazy. Are you ready? Are you set? Let's go. Are worth three, so it looked like only a little bit, but it was actually a lot. Yeah, I didn't need as much food as I thought. himself from attack. Money. Shields himself from attack. Nothing less, I cleared out a lot of inventory in the bank. <laughs> couple more hits, couple more hits. Each one's getting progressively stronger for him. Come on. One more hit. One more. 
Yes! Awesome! I beat him. Oh, look at all these people that were killed. Were captured. I rescued him. Awesome. You did it! You saved them! I never thought I'd see my friends and family again. Sarah Doman, bless you! Are you heading back to the mainland now? No. I have to go talk to you guys. Look at all these people. They're all happy. Talk to Hendrik. Hey, Hendrik. We have much to thank you for, my friend. It was nothing. May Sarah Doman watch over you. Looks like you saved the day. Don't you ever tire of being a fearless hero? Don't you ever tire? Oh, that's it. Haha, good one. Don't you ever tire of having to be rescued? Talk to Magda. You have delivered us from a terrible fate, my child. It was nothing. I always said you had potential. I'm glad to see I was right. Talk to Ned. I think it was almost turned into one of those things. Everyone is safe now. Yes, but for how long? The way things are going, I'd be better off living on the mainland. Let's see if I can get that lodestone that I was hoping for so I can warp back here if I ever need to. Instead of having to go take a boat. No, no, no free food? Okay. I found it! Activate it! Sweet! Or not. How come I can't activate? What am I doing wrong? Must be something fishy about it. Not letting me activate it. Here's a cow. I can get some milk. Examine villager. A resident of Ashford. Examine cow. Hey, there's fishies out here. Maybe there's a sardine. That would be interesting if I could... If they showed it like over here. You can see them right there. I have to go up on here and then... Toss my... It's about to jump. Any sardines? I need a sardine. Anybody, anybody. Interesting. I wonder if this is because it's nighttime and I need to come here by daytime or something. this house. Can I even enter it? Mm -hmm. Maybe not. Maybe it's nighttime. Nighttime but still people out selling stuff. Usually they cover it up and go home. Absolutely nothing for me. 
Peculiar, yeah. Alright, maybe I have to come back here. Hook at fire. Not seeing anything interesting. Oh, okay. Maybe I'm not high enough level or something. You have to do, you have to finish that quest and then I can come back and activate it. Yeah, that's it. Where's Lucy? Lucy, there you are. You want to go back? Sure, why not? Can't do anything else here anyway. Ask about Shadow over Ashley. Welcome back, laddie, and congratulations. Sounds like you had quite an adventure. To think that those creatures were beneath the island all that time. Makes my skin crawl just to think of it. You should have seen the size of their leader. There were all kinds of things lurking beneath the surface of the world. Things most folk would turn and run from. But you stood your ground, laddie. You should be proud. Wonder if there's any more of them beneath the island. I dare say there are. Without their leader, they probably re don't represent much of a threat, but it might be a good idea to go back to Ashdale once in a while and help keep their numbers down. Is there a reward? Ah, I nearly forgot. Here you go. Cool, look at those lamps. I made enough room in three black pearls, whatever those are. Access to the new Ashdale combat area, okay. So that's why I didn't have access to it before. Agaroth. Weekly Agaroth boss battle. Oh, I can fight that guy again and again, oh joy. No thank you. Imagine every week having to fight that guy. Alright, let's go back. Let's get that automatic lodestone. This is where I enter, okay. I can now talk to visit villagers. Or at least one villager. Hello, villager. Uh, it's you. It's me. You look happy to see me. You said two words, and you moved on. Here's Sarah again. When they got captured. Looks like you saved the day. What are you up to? Well, first I'm going to slay a few trolls, and then I'm going to sneak into a dragon's lair and steal all his gold. Or perhaps I'll spend the day doing mindless, repetitive chores. Either's fine with me. Yep, you do that. There's the lodestone, it's around the corner. Why couldn't I have activated it before? Alright, so I could talk to you a couple more up there. Ta da! Now let me activate. 
Ta da! There's Lucy again. Hello, good to see you again. What can I do around here? Since you're an adventurous type, head down to the Ashdale Caves. There's a stone pathway to on the northwest corner of the island leads directly to them. Still a lot of those crass and things down there, although they're not as direct threat on the town. Wouldn't hurt to keep the numbers down. Past the cows. Really weird walking rocky little trail, okay. Bye bye. Later. Let's see if these are at all worth fighting or if it's a bad idea. Let's talk to Ned. Hello. Oh, right. Don't get too familiar. You might have saved the town. But you should still show your elders the proper respect. Hello. How are you? Don't play the fool with me, young man. You know full well who I am. There's only one Ned Swarbrick on this island, and that's me. My family has been in Ashdale since the very beginning, and don't you forget it! It's a character. Enter tunnel. Okay, we're just checking it out. Yeah, these are little. Wonder if they're aggressive. Let's check out this dead man's chest we were just at. Fight him again. Watch the cutscenes. Name the reward. Um, no, I don't want to fight him again. There's only a hand so far. Wow, level 7 gets that same experience. So maybe they don't seem that hard, but... See, that's not much of a game. It's just... I'll try fighting one and see. Pretty easy, and they didn't bring on any more, so that's good. 53 experience, not bad. So that bank meant a chest you can open. If I don't get anything from beating these guys, uh, as far as um, items. No bones or anything. But experience is not bad. Rub some lamps, make some more space. So basically, I could just come get infinite cakes. I don't need to hold on to all this bread and other stuff. Cakes are so much better than... Hmm. Interesting. Learn something new every day.
I wonder if I fought him again, if it would be the same. I guess it wouldn't hurt to try. Um, the only problem is my health is not 100%. Probably won't want to fight until it is. Read journal entry. Having completed my initial sketches, today I begin my inspection of the site. To complete the house, we stand on a large sea stack at the southwestern end of the island, offering an excellent prospect of the surrounding area. Furthermore, the stack itself boasts a more, most remarkable feature, a steep vertical tunnel that leads directly to a large network of underground caves. Having explored only a small portion of these caves, I cannot be certain of their exact size, but it appears to extend for some distance beneath the island. I may even choose to incorporate an entrance to the caves into the house, as there is an opening in the first chamber that leads directly to the sea, and one never knows when such a thing may prove useful. Ah, must be what I'm at. I'm curious, and I have an infinite number of uh, cakes, so I'm going to go ahead and go for it and try again. Oh no, I have to beat the tentacles again first? Infinite cakes. Look what I can do with this. I really want to eat, eat the bread. See harder. I think he is because look at my health is much lower. I could try the attack potion. fight him again, but this time with no food.
Well, I got the warp thing. I'm gonna go ahead and call that good. I will come back and fight him when I'm really bored. Alright. What did I say I was gonna do next? Um, Hey, I need to get this load too. Let's get here and then go get that. Might be a lot of big monsters around there. I don't know. Let's let's look. I'm curious. Shadow over Ashdale. All right, so we're gonna go north. I know there's. Trying to make me not go this way. It's anyway. Enter wilderness. Alright, we got skeletons. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see, do they need nothing attacks me? They call this the level two area, so let's just go northeast. Level four, mm. level five, level six, level eight. Oh, a grizzly bear just attacked me. I was just going to pick up the bones. Gotta bury the bones. Alright, let's double check which way I'm going. I'm still going directly northeast. These are all people that didn't make it, right? Never came back for their bodies or something? Like that. An obelisk? I gotta examine that. I wonder what this stuff does. Hmm. Hey, there's the lodestone. We did. Cool. Unlock all. Wow, so I got that one and I got all of them. Listen to the goblin musician. So there's a wilderness, there's a bandit camp, Of chivalry. Hey, let's start this one. Sir Owen, the monastery west of Edgefield. Taking me to him? It appears to be. The 
owl hoots at midnight. The who at the what now? Never mind, good sir. Clearly you are not the contact I was sent here to meet. Although, you do look familiar. I guess I have one of those faces. Your modesty becomes you. I have heard great tales of your deeds from Ozan. I've no doubt that, in your case, he had little cause to exaggerate. Ceramic received a vision from Saradomin, telling him to send me here. I traveled to Edgeville Monastery with all haste, but I have yet to discover why. Sir Doman is probably wasting your time. Who is Sir Amit? Sir Doman must have had a good reason. I'm sure that all shall be revealed in good time. Bright lights. Hey, Saradomen. Mighty Saradomen. It is an honor to bear witness to your glory, my lord. Of all the days to neglect to polish my armor. Kneel before him. Please, there's no need to grovel. I could have done with your loyalty on the Lumbridge battlefield. For now, I entrust to both of you this sacred task. Put this in voice act. I support Armadil. Unlocked by God Emissary. How can I help you? Why would I help you? How can I help you? These are dark times. The protection of Luthix is no more. These are now lesser gods seek to claim dominion in my world with wearisome tenacity. Dark-hearted knights of Zamorak, the Kintra, have discovered a dangerous weapon last wielded during the God Wars. The Kintra have long sought to rule the kingdom of Asgania and obliterate my white knights. If the black knights seize this weapon, they will unleash terrible destructive power. The innocent citizens of Asgania will be slaughtered in their hundreds. I have chosen both of you to claim this artifact from the minions of Zavarak. Will you aid me? All right. Nothing new here. Enemies with life points and attacks that scale to your level, not weak to a specific combat style. So leave myself and be. We pledge our lives to your service, Saradomin. What must we do? First, your companion shall require a suitable disguise to infiltrate the Black Knight's fortress. Equip the armor I have provided to the southwest and return to me. You retrieve it? Now put it on. I think I got it all on. Let's see what he thinks. Is this good? How do I look? Good. Ooh, I look good. impersonate Captain Dalson, the current overseer of the Black Knight's fortress. Sir Owen shall accompany you. Disguised as a fellow Black Knight, my lord. I have a set of black armor from a former encounter with the King Shra. I need only claim it from storage. 
Now, Saron, I know well of your experience in stealth and infiltration, but great peril lies ahead. You must remain armed and ready for the battle that awaits. You will soon understand the wisdom of my actions. You shall be Captain Dulcens' prisoner. <laughs> the Kinshra have recently raided White Knight outposts in Asgardia and taken every opportunity to capture my followers alive. For what purpose, my lord? That is for you to discover, my faithful knight. My strength and intellect are yours to wield, Saradomin. That's me. I trust in your wisdom to lead me through the darkness. Excellent. With your permission, I shall now teleport you both to the Black Knight's fortress. All right. Reminds me of my monastery. Proceed to the tallest tower of the fortress and recover the weapon at any cost. Captain Dawson! Put your prattling, prattling pool and raise the portcullis. Yes, Captain. It's just that I thought you were upset, sir. Oh, I didn't see you in the fortress. And what were you doing with the Knight of Saradomin, sir? Progress bar at the top of the screen shows how suspicious. Act like a high-ranking black knight to maintain your disguise. Arousing too much suspicion will blow your cover. He's my prisoner. I'm taking my captive to the tallest tower of the fortress. My reasons are none of your concern. I thought I'd give him the tour. My reasons are none of your concern. Yes, yeah, sir. I'm sorry to have troubled you, sir. Well played. Now let's find a way up to the next level. I think I, I accidentally clicked on him. I haven't passed by the magic. Are you suggesting I can't handle a mere knight of Saradomin? Saradomin just sent the two of us. Ignore him. Are you suggesting I cannot handle a mere knight? You think me weak, guard? Absolutely not, sir. Perhaps you wish to challenge me to a duel. Will a mortal wound satisfy your curiosity? That won't be necessary, sir. Please continue, Captain Dalson. I wanted to go up, not down. Is securely locked in. Up, up, climb up staircase. There we go. Captain Dawson. What do you want? I'm sorry to bother you, Captain, but prisoners are not permitted on the upper levels. By whose orders? Prisoner is to be sacrificed. Alright, stand aside or you will regret it. Oh, yes, sir. My humble apologies, Captain. Please continue up the stairs, Captain Dawson. Alright, so I made it up. There's a slave. There's another slave. Is there anything else? There's another slave. I'm looking for a higher tower, so I need to go up, up, up. 
I suppose if I go through this door, I can see people. What's that over here? Let's look this way. This is just a big room. <laughs> Out here, there's a bunch of people in here. Oh, it's mess hall. Examine the elite black knight. Push pit. Fuck. Lots of combat experience. Okay. Let's see. Am I allowed to go over here? What? There's a door here. What's in there? Slave quarters. Okay. Ah, Captain Dalsim. You have arrived at an opportune time. Are you ready to receive the mark of Zavarak? Receive the mark of Zimrak. Yes. Splendid. Remove your helmet, and I shall administer the mark. Remove your helmet. You are not Captain Dalsim. I knew it. Imposter! We have an imposter in our midst. They've sounded the alarm. Our cover's broken. We best hide until the Black Knights finish their search. Shall we continue our quest? You must wear the armor of a Black Knight Captain before we can continue. Shall we continue our quest? Oops. I'm at the beginning. I already got past him. That's going down again, down a ladder. Staircase. Wrong way. Push pitch bucket. What is that? I've known men that suffered under a torrent of boiling oil. It's not a pretty fate. Hey, here we go. Around the outside. Anything over here? Hmm. Pray at the altar. Okay. Oh, it's the priest in there, okay. I'm exploring alternate ways besides talking to that priest. Hmm. In here. Can I even squeeze through there? Probably not. to slay. Nothing. 
Alright, well, I guess I gotta talk to that guy. He wants me to get the mark. Ah, Captain Dalsin. You have arrived at an opportune time. Are you ready to receive the mark of Zavarak? Yes. Splendid. Remove your helmet, and I shall administer the mark. You have no authority over me, priest. I serve Zamorak. I have no tiresome blessing. I need no tiresome blessing from you to prove my allegiance to the Lord of Chaos. Stand aside or I shall strike you down. I preach seized with fury but manages to restrain himself. I will be watching you, Captain. You cannot hide from Zamorak's gaze. You may proceed up the southeast stairs, Captain Dawson. Hey, it worked. Uh, excuse me, Captain Dawson. I cannot permit the Celadonis to access the upper levels of the fortress. Fool, he's to be sacrificed. I'm bringing him to the tallest tower. Why? What's on your upper levels? Never mind. I'm bringing him to the tallest tower. For what purpose? We need him to recover the weapon of power, as you know. This one's stubborn. He needs some extra encouragement. Oh, I see. It's a long drop from up there, Sir Dominus. You're talking in that what's good for you. Hey, we made it. Search shelves? No, that would look suspicious. Inspect tapestry? No, that would look suspicious. We need to go up, up, up. He's gonna talk to me and say, hey, why are you trying to get past me? Captain Dawson, I have grave news. Ooh. The magic circle has ceased to function, and I can find no trace of your witch. I fear our operation has been sabotaged, sir. We have lost contact with the artifact. Report, soldier. Gladly, my lord. How can I be of assistance? What of the artifact? The weapon, sir. The artifact that Lord Nicarius promised would give us the power to destroy Thalador. Tell me the magic circle. Your witch took up residence in the attic tower. You were there when she cast the ritual, Captain. The ritual circle has been damaged. The gateway has vanished, and without the witch, we cannot reopen it. Tell me of the witch. The witch you hired, Captain Dolson, to summon a gateway to the weapon we seek. She claimed to be loyal to Zamorak. I am beginning to suspect she was an agent of the White Knights. The knight glares suspiciously at Sir Owen and says nothing. Stand aside, I will yes, handle this. I shall detain the prisoner while you investigate your chambers, Attic Tower. Prisoner stays with me. Captain Dawson, with respect, sir, I must insist. Enemy agents may have infiltrated the fortress in disguise. Blue. Oh. Thanks for the distraction. You might want to see if he's carrying anything useful. The captain's quarters are just up ahead. You find 250 coins. Okay. Witnesses. I'll make sure he doesn't suffer. Don't kill him. We'll tie him up somewhere. As you wish. I hope this doesn't come back to bite us in the future. I'm not afraid. Now, let's investigate that attic tower. The captain's quarters are just to the north of us. Just north. Okay, so I can go through there, but they have all these... Salmon weapon rack. See if I can get some weapons. Nope. Salmon door. Solid wood door. Okay, there's some 
people fighting over there. Crack open safe. Or not. Salmon treasure. Literally pots of money. Salmon shell. Proudly displayed collection of looted Dragon. Captain Dulcin appears to be quite the dragon slayer. No wonder his men hold him in such high regard. He's clearly a capable warrior. I hope we don't run into this chap in person. Oh, you know we will. Alright. I'm going to stop at this point um, because it's probably going to be another much longer quest so I'm gonna go ahead and put a cut in the video but we made a lot of progress we did the nighttime in Ashdale and started this big quest and a lot of fun and thanks a lot for watching and look forward to next time Mangler 3M on out